Hey everyone, there are quite a bit of things we're going to have to go over today, so buckle up for some- ah! Hey uncle! Casper, don't you dare scare me like that again. Nearly had a goddamn heart attack. Pocket Tokoro, ladies and gentlemen. Good kid, but a better trickster. I've decided that today, you will be relieved of your duties. What? I'm gonna take over today's coffee break. Casper, you don't understand- Zip it, Uncle Barb. You've been acting weird ever since you did this whole ferrofluid thing, and I'm thinking it's taking too much of a toll on your mental health. Ferrofluid? What are you talking about? Yeah, you, you released two songs that were really concerning. I think you need to seriously step away from it. Do you think the people on the other side know? About my life? Nah. They only know about DM Dokoro. Just like they know about Pocket and Solar. I don't think it'll matter now, since I still need to fill them in anyway. Ah! Still doing that whole journal thing you've been talking about? Of course. In case anything happens to me, everything about this voice in my head will be explained there. And that about proves it. Rest. Now! Go! Casper! Shoot Casper, you! do you even know how Stop to host this? this? Casper, they are fickle! It has to be! Let me in, or no God help me, I will okay. this door! Now let's get this over with before he truly gets mad! Get out of my fucking studio, Casper! Sit! And little does he know, I can actually imitate him quite well. It's weird how family works. So why is this happening? Suddenly we get a coffee break? Um, it's because... <laughs> yeah, I'm moving. But that's not to say that that's all the news that there is. Calamity content will be coming back. However, because of this whole moving thing, I probably will not be coming back until May 2nd. Or at least until I'm done with moving out. Sit. I bet you've been waiting for this. Calamity news. Uh, guess what? I have to actually redo the Acid Rain event theme. Mainly because my first idea was a little bit more towards the nice, chill-out, mellow tune. Except it isn't that. It's far from that, actually. It's pretty much one of those Pirate Invasion Goblin Army events. So that means I have to increase the brutality. That will probably be done by the time I'm done moving. Sorry about that, by the way. Sit! Right then, let's head on to our favorite subject! Oh man, I always wanted to say this! Lego! Question 1! Do you like fighting games? Not if they make me throw the controller to the other side of the room, fucking as well. Question 2! Have you invested into pixel art at all? I dabbled into it. But due to my artistic skill being comparable to that of a walnut dipped in paint, it might not be on the cards. Question 3! Have you ever played a physical instrument? I'm trying to learn how to play piano. Question 4! Do you plan on ever revisiting Crypt of the Necrodancer? Probably not at the moment. Question 5! Will you make more original songs in the future? I kinda have to. Question six! What normally makes you calm if you're too stressed? Sleeping prevents insanity. Question seven! What was your favorite genre of music when growing up? My mom and dad had a wide array of salsa classics from the Fania label. Most of the songs I've listened to and remembered throughout my youth was a lot of songs by Sonora Ponceña. Question eight! Opinion on Terraria Journey's End. Good for them. Question 9! What's your favorite intangible concept? Rapture by either a god or extraterrestrial being. I'm actually a sucker for end of the world type shit. Question 10! Do you believe that brute force is always a solution? Only when my back is against the wall. Question 11! Where did you learn music theory? I wish I knew more about music theory. The more knowledge I have on those sweet chords and progressions, the more my music will grow. Question 12! 
Who's your current Smash main? Banjo and Kazooie. Question 13! What's your profile pic all about? This was actually a commission from Flutter Sprite. I made a couple of tracks for their game, Grapple Force Reina. Question 14! What is the most cursed thing you've seen on YouTube? If I had to go with absolutely making me question the reality of the world, it would probably be... Wait, wouldn't you just be sending me that shit if I answered? Question 15! Do you like listening to your own music? Only when I'm out of the house. Question 16! Where can I send art for Sugar Cube? Well, I have a, a Twitter. I have an email. That's all the places I know at the moment. If you have any other places that I can accept art, please do let me know. Question 17! Which calamity piece did you put the most effort into? Which calamity piece was I constantly bothered for over and over again? Question 18! What are your thoughts on Peach? Okay, real talk though? If I were to hit Peach and he were to hit me, would I be the one screaming or would he be the one screaming? Question 19! Will you ever forgive Aaron? If I can fucking get to her! And finally, question 20! How do you go about naming your songs? By the relevance of their story. Sit. And that about wraps it up for this month's coffee break. A quick shout out to all the contributing patrons this month, and I shall see you all next ah! See you soon! The door! Now! For real though, I need to get back to work.